Hey guys, it's your girl Candidly V and I am back with another video. So for those of you that know, or for those of you that don't know, um, I have recently launched my handcrafted tea business. <laughs> And today I've had a lot of questions about how to steep loose leaf tea. So today's video is a help me video and a how to video on how to steep loose leaf tea. I hope that you guys enjoy it. If you didn't know how to do it, you're gonna learn today. Let's get into this video. For this video, what you will need, I'm just gonna, you're gonna need hot water. I've got my kettle here, which is already pre-boiled. Um, you will need your tea that you're gonna use. Um, I personally have a, um, a steeper, a permanent steeper. So it look, mine looks like this, but I also have some that I'm selling on the site that you can, that's like a forever steeper, okay? Thank you. Or you also can use a tea filter bag, one like this. Now, most of us at home have a teaspoon. Now, this teaspoon is pretty big. You will not need that much. As you can see, the size of this compared to the tea bag is pretty big. So you're not gonna wanna fill this, even though it does say one teaspoon, you don't need to. Um, and then I also have my beautiful scooper, tea scooper. But this is just what I have. Not everybody has one of these. For those of you that do at home, then you can measure it out. But for the rest of you, most likely you're gonna have a teaspoon, okay? I am going to show you how to put it in this little steeper. I mean, in the little strainer. And then I will also show you how to use a tea bag. So, first things first, you never want to completely fill your tea bag. So I'm just gonna open the hole just a little bit. And then I am going to, teaspoon, I'm gonna grab some of my tea. And I'm just going to put it in to said bag like this. And then you can see, this is roughly how much tea, oh, I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so this is roughly how much tea, oh, it's so bright, okay. So this is roughly how much tea you want to have in your tea bag. Never fill the tea bag up because when you add water to your loose leaf tea, the tea bag, the tea leaves expand. Obviously when you add water to things, things get bigger. So you want to leave some space because the tea bags so that they can expand so that you can get full flavor of everything and they have space to go and the water has space to move in between the tea bags. It's very important. You do not want to. So, I, so if I fold over the tea bag, this is how much tea so you can see is in there. Okay. You can add a little bit more if you want to but I wouldn't necessarily suggest it. So you really want to have like about a half a tea bag filled with some tea. And it's very simple. You open the hole, you grab how much tea you want to put in there. You grab how much tea you want to put in there and then you literally just put the tea bag in like that and you're good to go. Okay, and then you can literally pull this shut and then what I like to do, so I just pull the tea bag shut. And then what I like to do is I usually will take the tea bag and I will knot it just so that the tea leaves stay within the tea bag when the water gets added. Okay, so that is how you use a tea bag filter. This usually comes like this on top. You open it up, you've got your little scooper, you can add I'll use my scooper this time. This is how much on my scooper I have, just about enough. I just literally pop it in there. As you can see, this is not filled. 
okay? It's not filled, so you still have space once again to filter through. We're gonna pop the lid on, and then I'm gonna show you what the next step is. One second. Okay, so I already have my mug here. What I'm gonna do is my tea bag, my tea is already inside of the strainer. I'm just gonna pop that into the cup. This one, I can bend over the cup, like said, like so. And then I'm just going to pour my water in, my hot water in, to the mug, to exactly where I need it to go. Okay. So however much tea you wanna make, just pour that in. Then what we're gonna do is leave it to sit and to steep. You can probably already see, like this tea is a red color. So you can already, oh, this tea is a red color. So you can already see, sorry the guys, the light is like, ooh. oh no, it's this, okay. You can already see the tea being formed and it's steeping, okay? So you will need to leave that there for a couple of minutes. You don't really need to do much in this process. And the same thing with the tea bag. You'll have the tea bag in. You can either swirl it around like I'm doing. This helps it steep a little bit faster, but you don't have to. You can also leave it in and just let it be. But what I will do is I will sit down. I will let the tea steep for a couple of minutes, say three minutes. I'll just let it sit like this for three minutes. Then I will get my spoon, I will add my sugar. You can have sugar, you can put honey in. It just depends on what you like to sweeten your tea with. Okay, so I have removed the tea. I'm just gonna add some sugar into my tea because I like sugar in my tea or I like honey in my tea. So I'm just gonna add one tablespoon of sugar. I like it sweet, y'all, don't judge me. So one tablespoon of sugar is more than enough for me. And that is how to steep your perfect loose tea. See guys, it doesn't take any much longer than any other tea, but this way you're getting full flavor and not broken down tea leaves. You are getting the full flavor of that tea. So I hope that you guys go and enjoy your loose leaf tea, candle leaf teas. I'm gonna link it down below. I'm gonna put my IG handle in and obviously my site where you can go and purchase some loose leaf teas if that's something that you're interested in. I hope you guys actually got something out of this video and learned how to steep loose leaf tea. If you have any other questions, please feel free to drop them down below in the comment section. Otherwise, also, sorry, for anybody new here, welcome. I hope you come back again to my channel. Don't forget to hit that like button. Give me those thumbs up, guys. Don't forget to leave a comment. And don't forget to hit that beautiful red button saying subscribe with that bell on. Okay, so you do not miss another upload. And then what I'm gonna say is bon appetit. <laughs> Enjoy your tea, guys, because this is the perfect brew. I can't wait to see you on the next video. Thank you guys so much. Have a great one. Bye.